Jeffrey, obviously difficult uh, first half. Wondering if you've been a part of anything like that in your short time here, you know, six possessions and six scores. And, and you know, what were they doing um, particularly well in that first half? I mean, it's, it's, it's obvious, you know, we, they, they got a couple of passes down the field. Um, we got to do a better job just by uh, affecting the quarterback, especially on them type of um, on them deals. When you know, especially when they the first thing is to run the ball, and you know, you you stopping the run. But at the same time, you know, you can still have a quarterback that can throw the ball as well down in the field to the receivers. So, you know, we just got to do a better job um, as a whole defense. You know, especially early on in the game, we got to be able to start fast. You know, especially get off the field, um, get the ball back to our offense, so they can you know get the field advantage and you know. Score points. So, Gentry. Yeah, Jeffrey. Uh, some other guys have said, you know, this wasn't characteristic of, of how you guys have, have played. And uh, how how surprised were you to have it get away the way it did? Man, I, it's one of the, yeah, like we talk about. Um, let's play all style of football, and especially on defense, let's fly around and have fun. It's great turnovers and things like that in that nature. But, I mean. You know, they came out, um, the Browns, you know, give props to them. You know, they were making more plays than we we made. So it wasn't more surprise. It was just like, you know, let's get back to it. Let's settle down, you know, especially with me. You know, you know they got a first down and just a, you know, dumb penalty after the play. And I just got to be smarter with that and stuff like that. You know, we can't hurt ourselves just by, you know, when it come down to playing football, especially on defense, you know, one little thing, one little mess up, you know, could mess up a whole play. So everybody doing their job, you know, up front, the linebacker, and on the um, in the secondary. You know, like I said, we we didn't did it before. We just play that style of football. We'll be just fine. Jim Wyatt, Jeffrey, what what is the frustration level like then? This team had won two games in a row, came here, big game against the Browns, and find yourself down, you know, big at the half. And how do you get? How do you overcome this moving forward? It's always frustrating losing. Um, I never like losing no matter what it is. Um, and I know this team don't like losing. So it's always frustrating losing. But at the same time, you know, this lead, this lead don't stop because we lose. We have to, we have to um, watch for them, get correction. You know, especially how can we, the way we play the second half, how can we translate that to the first half to make sure that we don't get behind, so we can play the game ahead and, you know, make sure that we, we, we're not trying to fight back at the end of the game just to try to get a stop and get a score. Because, I mean, time ran out. And like I said, just that's not the way we play football. And that's not the way – that's not our style of, of playing football, especially on the defensive side. We like to stay ahead. We like to get off the field, get a ball back to our offense. And that's pretty much what it is. We just got to figure out how can we – you know, Brave said, how can we get that second half football translated to that first half football. And like I said, that's, that's basically what it is. I mean, we played all – style of defense and offense and everything came together that second half. But like I said, it was, it was just too late. And, and we just can't, we can't do that playing this game of football, especially getting a team like that with the Browns. Terry? Jeffrey, uh, third downs continue to be a problem and the pass rush and all continues to be an issue. Um, are these things that are fixable at this point or you just have to kind of make do? You know, um, Harry, we just trust in the game plan. You know, we're doing our best and trying to get, you know, in the quarterback phase. We we got to do better. We got to do a better job for sure. But, you know, we we trust in this game plan that we're going to keep, you know, we got to, of course, you want to get off the field on third down. But at the same time, you know, it's not all about sacks. It's not all about, you know, just interceptions. It's how can you affect the quarterback to call bad throws, you know, Give them, give them the arm, um, just live it over, and we maybe get an interception. So, not all about sacks, true enough, we want sacks, but you know, we're gonna keep trusting this game plan. And you know, this is not, not just, I mean, of course, we're struggling probably today, but let's talk about us. You know, we're just not a bad, we're not a bad team on third down. You know, early in the season, we was, you know, we was like, dang, we gotta get out the field, but you know, we didn't have great games where we didn't got out the field on third down, and we didn't, been, we'd have been up and Get the ball back to the offense. So that's not one thing we would just uh, suck on third down. And we just got to play all style of defense on third down and first and second down and everything else falling in place. So. 
Jeffrey, isn't there some danger to, to putting a lot of credence into what you guys did in the second half, given that the Browns had to feel pretty comfortable that, that, that they had the game if they didn't mess up? You say that is in danger? Yeah, well, everybody's saying, well, we just have to do what we did in the second half. Well, it strikes me that the Browns weren't particularly worried in the second half because of what they did in the first half. Well, I think when we say we got to do what we did in the second half, that's playing to our identity, and that's our getting off the field, scoring, stuff like that. It's not nothing the Brown were doing. We were just doing a better job on defense and offense and special teams. We just we got back to playing all style of football as the Titans on defense, offense, and special team in the second half. That's what we talking about when we talk about let's put translate the second half to the first half. Yeah, uh, Jeffrey, the um, Browns came in with the uh, with the number one Russian attack in the league. Uh, they ended up throwing for almost 300 yards in the first half. Uh, a little bit of a surprise to you guys that, uh, you know, they went heavy on the pass instead of the run? I mean, they tried to run the ball. I mean, they that, they came out trying to run the ball. You know, we were shutting it down. But that's, that's just like I said earlier, we have to be able to, especially up front, we have to be able to, to affect the quarterback. That's why I'm like, no, and it's not all the third down because they were throwing the ball on first and second down, getting big game. So we still have to find a way to affect the quarterback, translating our rushes, um, you know, faster and stuff like that. So, I mean, you know, team gonna do that, and, and especially playing with the defensive line we have and the linebackers as a whole defense. You know, we came in this game to stop the run, but also, you know, we, we don't want to give up the big plays, and you know, we're gonna be better, and you know, we got to put this game how we're gonna. Do the correction and get the correction, and you know, like it's the NFL. You know, when people are just football itself. You know, you can't run the ball, you gonna throw the ball. You can't throw the ball, just keep trying to run the ball. So, you know, we just gotta be better on defense as a whole.